Let's get you live updates coming in. Prime Minister Modi will step on uh, the decorative vehicle now. The historic meeting between the Spain uh, Prime Minister and Prime Minister Modi is underway. We are getting you live visuals from the spot as uh, the Prime Minister and the Spanish Prime Minister Sanchez will jointly inaugurate the Tata Advanced Systems Limited facility in Vadodara. So this inauguration comes after a roadshow from the airport to the Tata facility. The Prime Minister has inaugurated uh, the facility jointly with the Spanish Prime Minister, Pedro Sanchez, who arrived in Vadodara earlier today. My colleague Arunil is joining us on the broadcast with the details. Arunil, take us through the significance of this visit and uh, the inauguration. The state-of-the-art facility is spread across 36 acres. This is after a joint deal had been inked with Spain. Take us through the details and the significance of this visit. Well, historic day, Pratibha, for uh, the India and Spanish ties. This is a, for the first time in 18 years wherein a Spanish Prime Minister is landing on Indian soil. At present, I'm reporting from the airport circle. This is where PM Modi basically arrived here around half an hour ago uh, in his black vehicle. He got down. Uh, he uh, stepped on the decorative vehicle. Following him was uh, the Spanish Prime Minister, Pedro Sanchez. Uh, they both uh, basically embarked on a very colorful uh, road show with performers on the side of the uh, road, uh, people uh, posing as great personalities from India. Uh, there were dance performers, performances from different states uh, of India. Now the inauguration of uh, this military uh, aircraft center in Vadodara, that is C-295 aircraft uh, that has been made uh, by in collaboration with Tata and uh, uh, Spain's Airbus is a historic event because this is the first time wherein a private company or an entity is making military aircraft. It can not only suffice uh, the immediate needs of Indian Air Force, the aging fleet can be replaced uh, 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 in some time now, uh, but also it basically showcases that how India wants to show itself as a key player in the aerospace industry. Across Vadodara, people of Vadodara were waiting over here to catch a glimpse of uh, their Vishwa Guru, that is PM Narendra Modi. Nar uh, PM Modi got down from his vehicle, waved at the crowd. The cry crowd also uh, basically uh, gave a rousing reception to uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Uh, this event, this uh, meet between uh, the Spanish Prime Minister, that is uh, Pedro Sanchez and PM Modi, is extremely significant for India's Mediterranean out outreach as well. It can basically bolster uh, the trade ties, cultural ties and uh, primarily the defence ties between these two countries. After the inauguration, uh, PM Sanchez and PM Narendra Modi will be going to the iconic and historic, the magnificent Lakshmi Vilas Palace, which is the uh, historic residence of uh, the Gaikwad family, the erstwhile royal family of, uh, uh, of Baroda. That is where an MOU will be signed between these two countries. It can basically boost a uh, trade and also garner employment for uh, the people of India. Uh, post that, a lavish lunch has also been organized. Uh, PM Sanchez, who's on a three-day visit, will be going to the financial capital, that is Mumbai, to meet several business leaders in Mumbai, as well as uh, several okay. Bollywood uh, personalities and producers mm. also. Uh, this meet between uh, these two countries countries, that is India and Spain, is extremely, extremely uh, significant from various uh, perspectives as well. It can okay. uh, bolster uh, the import and imp uh, export trade uh, between these two countries. And also it is part of... Okay, all right. Arunil, thank you for joining us with those details. We come back to you for those updates. It's a significant visit, like you mentioned, and the first C-295 aircraft is expected to roll out from the Vadodara facility in September 2026. On that note, we're slipping into a short break here. We'll be right back. Do stay with us.